Everybody, it has been a very exciting night here at the Embassy Suites in, in Ridgeland, but also a very historical night. And I'm here with the woman of the hour. She is the first female to be elected to the Attorney General's Office in Mississippi, Treasurer Lynn Fitch. Ma'am, congratulations. First off, tell me, with, with it all over now, how does it feel to, to make this accomplishment to serve Mississippi, your home state? Thank you so very much. I'm so honored. I'm so humbled um, that the people of the state of Mississippi have elected me to serve as the Attorney General. We did make history tonight, all of us together. It's exciting to be able to serve as the first female Attorney General and represent the state of Mississippi. So truly an honor for me. Now talk to me about your top three priorities. You had mentioned drug smuggling and human trafficking being a problem through Mississippi, the possibility with border security, working with President Trump. How is that going to tie into your first year in office? Well, absolutely. I'm going to work very diligently. You know, many things we've talked about on the campaign trail, those will actually be implemented when we get to the AG's office. Certainly, we're going to partner with our law enforcement, be supportive. We're going to talk about how we protect those across the state of Mississippi, our most vulnerable, how we protect our Mississippi rights, then how we rally together to fight the opioid crisis and end the human trafficking issue. What The numbers were coming in. When did you realize you really started to have it and just what was going through your mind as you saw the votes come in and you realized voters were getting your message? It was so exciting, you know, with my family. My family's been on this journey with me, and that's been very important. And as we saw the numbers really coming and getting close, we're so excited. We feel so very blessed. And everyone that's been such great supporters for me all along this journey, it's just been such a, a true honor. Do you see yourself as a trailblazer for women who want to, who are aspiring to become politicians one day? First the state treasurer's office, first female elected 2012, and now this, where you started decades ago. Tell me about that and the inspiration you want to send out there. Well, it's just so exciting to think that I started at the Attorney General's office 34 years ago, and now I have the opportunity to go back and serve there. And I truly want to be an inspiration for all Mississippians, but for women, young women, to really think about how they can serve and to get into the political arena and how I can be there empowering them in any way that I possibly can. Okay, we are talking to Attorney General-elect Lynn Fitch, the first female in Mississippi to be elected to this office. We'll have a full recap of tonight coming up in our early morning newscast and updates on our website website wjtv.com ma'am congratulations thank you so much reporting in ridgeland live i'm alex love wjtv 12 news